One of the essential moments for, for me of telematics was actually when the Americans have launched GPS and have opened the systems for the civil usage. And the principal idea of Webfleet was born roughly in 1997 and developed actually a web-based fleet management solution, what we launched end of 1999. In the, in the end of the 90s, what I said, GSM standard became more and more clear in all the different countries, the network providers and the, uh, the network uh, suppliers have actually agreed to the standard, what I feel is one of the of the most uh, impressive things uh, that has influenced our life today because without a mobile data communication standard we would not have nowadays a mobile internet available. The principles are the same. The principles that people want to know where people are, the principle uh, to know where your cars are, where your trucks are, what they're doing, to understand uh, remotely uh, something that has stayed the same. And I think it's the basic foundation of what we call nowadays the Internet of Things. We're heading into a completely digitized world, we, we know it, or we may not even recognize it uh, uh, in, in the usage of our smartphones, in the usage of our browsers, the web, the access to education, all that stuff drives our world forward. It's essential to move forward uh, that entrepreneurs, decision makers in companies should care about the program, how to bring their companies into a digital life, in a digital world. If you look a little bit more what TomTom -tom does, I think connectivity, uh, autonomous cars, self-driving cars uh, is a big thing and we will likely see this within the next 15 years in a much, much more broader uh, penetration on the roads that helps us to get cleaner cities, uh, less traffic, less jams in the cities. That's what I deeply believe. Technology will help us to understand the world in a better way and it makes us our life more easier and uh, we as humans we need to drive that actually. We need to stay flexible in this world and then I think we have a very prospering future in front of us.